everybody. Welcome to Santa Fe Super Chief at Kansas City Union Station. We begin on an early spring morning at Kansas City Union Station's coach yard and engine facility located just west of the station. We arrive just as the hostler is preparing to deliver today's power, an AV set of Alco PAs, led by number 59, to the Santa Fe Super Chief consist waiting at the station. As the PAs pass under the signal bridge spanning the eight-track throat to the station, they're met by Missouri Pacific's westbound, train number 11, the Colorado Eagle, as it departs for Denver and Los Angeles. Moments later, the Warbonnet PAs are joined by Union Pacific's eastbound city of St. Louis, as it arrives from Denver, behind an AB set of PAs led by number 602. As the hostler eases the PAs past Tower 5, he'll proceed all the way through the station to the east end of the complex, before backing into the train shed, and coupling onto the waiting Super Chief consist. After coupling his PAs to the waiting Super Chief consist, the hostler will be replaced by the train's long-range crew to complete the remainder of the Super Chief's journey to its final destination, Chicago's Union Station. After new and continuing passengers are boarded, and all pre-departure preparations are complete, the continuation of Santa Fe's extra fare, train number 18, the Super Chief, is ready to depart eastbound towards its final destination, Chicago's Union Station. Passing under the McGee Street Bridge, the Super Chief meets Missouri Pacific's westbound train number 9, the Missourian, as it arrives at Kansas City's Union Station, behind an ABBA set of Alco FAs. As we watch the sleek streamliner continue its journey eastbound to Chicago's Union Station, we bid goodbye to Santa Fe's finest, most luxurious passenger train, train number 18, the Super Chief. Until next time, be sure and click the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching.